Hello Summoners and Summonettes, it's Gordon here, and today I'm bringing you episode 5? Maybe 6? I always lose track of the Diamond in the Rough series, so today we are on the Jungle Warwick, so we'll go ahead and start Machete 4, as well as that Warding Totem here. Hi, I'm Gordon Gullick, have fun. And I forgot to show you guys at the end of last video how much LP we gained, but I think we gained 26 or 27, so... We're doing pretty good. Our MMR is still pretty high on this account, so once we get into a series, we should skip to gold 2, I believe. We'll skip gold 3 more than likely. So it's looking good for us. So We are against a kill jungle with teleport, and then they have a hecarim top with exhaust. So I'm not sure what kind of stuff we ran into here, but it's definitely interesting. So it looks like we might do some bay work. Nice, it connects. Oh, the exhaust coming out. That's gonna, yeah, that's gonna force a flash out of her. Very nice. So exhaust for flash, always worth. Might try and, um, I'm a Warwick, honestly. Like, yeah, there's no flash in that lane. Probably they're gonna have to take advantage in the 2v2. Because I'm gonna try and farm up to level 6, honestly. You can't do too much as Warwick pre-6, so. More than likely, the flash is just gonna have to be used to outplay them in that 2v2 lane. And I don't know if I want to go Madstone Warwick, or whatever the hell it's called, where you go Spirit Stone as well as Claws. I'll probably just end up going Madrids, and then actually pretty tanky for the most part, because I feel like I need to be the tank that the team needs here. I did start Q, and I actually think it would have been better to start my W, but oh well. I'll be level 2 soon enough here, so we'll be able to get that W without an issue. There's the W, and I actually should not have used it, because it's a pretty long cooldown. Kill it, what the hell? <laughs> and I would have liked to have that up on the wolves, actually, so I've already made two mistakes, I think. Oh well, moving on to the big wolf here. And I should have probably purchased a mana potion as well, instead of four health potions. Three mistakes already, off to a good start. Alright, there goes the big wolf, and we'll just nuke out these little ones real quick. And we'll try and kite it so we save some time here. And we'll go to red now. Oh, nice. They awarded my red, too. <laughs> I don't think that actually got in the bush, but I appreciate the gesture. All right. So red buff, here we come. Hopefully Kale won't hit us here. So I'm going to award that just so I don't have to go in the bush because I'm lazy. And I'm really lazy, and I'm going to smite early, which is super risky. But I want to get that cooldown ticking. Alright, we got red buff. Very nice. I'm going to go ahead and put another point in my W here. And then level 4 we will probably pick up the blood sun, but until then, don't really need it because we're just planning on clearing out that jungle anyways. So we're going to do the golems here. Pretty simple here. We're going to be playing Farmville for this game. I'm not lying to you guys. We're just going for that fast level 6 here. And probably so is the kill, honestly. So we might meet up a little bit later on in the game here. There goes Wraiths, got my smite up for, or Golem, got my smite up for the Wraiths. And I'm just going to immediately smite the big Wraith here just to leash it. Start it up here. Very nice. And we should be level 4 after another clear of the Wolves, so that'll be good for us. Can pick up that Blood Sun and then maybe try and get in and gank a lane here, but probably not. Just doing full clears, baby. Bot lane, how are you guys doing? Ooh, Thresh is actually pretty chunked. A little scary for him. Alright, Farmville. Okay, they just warded River. I see that now. So I might have to try and come through lane here with maybe a Dark Passage from the Thresh that could sneak me in there. And I am gonna, gonna go ahead and do the White Camp before we get to that bot lane anyway, because Smite is up. want to make use of that cooldown as much as possible, especially in the early game here. Still, we'll have my red buff if we do try and come here for a bot gank, so we'll try and do this real quick while the jungle respawns, and then we can just go back if this is unsuccessful anyways. Mention me and brah. I think they could, <laughs> they could see me from the picks. Oh god, he got it though. Where's the lantern, homie? Alright, she doesn't have flash though, so this should be good. Nice, first blood. I didn't even have to flash that. I was thinking about flashing and attempting to slow her with the red buff, but Lucian's got my back. And we got that first blood anyways. Gonna go ahead and swipe you to guarantee that. Nice, so. Ooh, flash dude, very nice. I get to go back with a ton of gold on me here. 
Just gonna get the Madrids real quick and simple here, and then we'll pick up boots, and we'll actually start picking up some wards here as well. Don't know why I bought another potion. You don't really need pots as Warwick, but whatever. I'm gonna go top and clear all the way down to my blue buff, so by the time that spawns, it'll be good for us here. Fucking jewel. What? Oh. Oh, pre... Yeah, good pre-6 gank. Definitely. I agree with you wholeheartedly there. It is amazing if Warwick gets on the board pre-6. Alright. Gonna go ahead and grab a point in Q here. I like alternating Q and W. I'll max my W first, but some points early on in Q is pretty good just for sustain in the jungle. And we'll do the wraith here. I gotta think what I wanna build, because... They have double AP. I might just build an early Spectre's Cowl, and then we can build something like Frozen Heart or Randuin's on top of that. And then if we get super far ahead, we can build something like a Bork and go a little more damage oriented Warwick. We definitely have some options though. So, just gonna clear out the wolves here, and then we'll do the white and blue buff should be up. Actually, spamming that Hungering Strike is. Very, very non-mana efficient. I don't know if I said that grammatically correct, but whatever. So I should actually try and be a little bit more conservative on my Q spams here and just W spam because W is very little mana cost and you get really good stats from that. Blue buff, 22 seconds. Ugh. I actually kind of mistimed that a little bit. Oh, we got ganked. Oh, that actually means I could steal red buff here because Kale was in that top lane, so... She kind of ganked at the wrong time, in my opinion, if she did start red. Because her buffs are about to spawn, and that means I can just easily get in and steal one. And that is a free red buff for me. And I'll be level 6, and I can rotate straight down to bot lane, and hopefully make use of them not having flash there. And I'm going to be a jerk and leave one lizard up. And I'm actually going to toss a pink ward in there and get a very deep pink ward. Oh, go, 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 go. Nope. I've been spotted. Well, I'm gonna steal your ward on the way out. I don't want the lantern. Thank you, though. I'm just gonna go ahead and do blue. Maybe we'll give this to Lux if she wants it. If not, I would love it, because I'm pretty low on mana, but I'll give her the option as to whether or not she wants it. Oh, she's gonna die. Never mind. Okay, nice flash, nice flash. I guess I'm just gonna have to take this little blue buff, because you're so far away. I'm sorry, Lux. I really, really wanted to give it to you, but you know. Oh, she died anyways. <laughs> well, we'll see if I can sneak in here. I'm going to turn off my blood scent for now, just to see if we can creep up on her. She has A. What the hell? I ain't ganking that. Never mind. Is she going to stay for the wave, though? I doubt she will. All right, I'm just going to go to my red buff. Yeah, she's not going to stay there. So we can maybe sneak a dragon here, if we can gank bot and force a kill there, but... Until then, we will just clear out our Jimmy, and I'm a-okay with just farming up, honestly. Kind of lackadaisical, kind of boring, but eventually plays will be made, fear not. I might even come top lane here, because Hecarim is pretty low. Yeah, we can sneak a gank in here. I doubt he has flash from the gank. I don't know, I could probably ask, but I'm pretty lazy. Oh, the Rengar ult. This is, this is a kill. Yep. Nice. Very nice. And there's the flash. I'm going to go ahead and just ult. And Rengar gets the kill there. I don't know if the ult was necessarily needed, but I don't know if Hecarim had ult. So I really didn't want him to ult away and kind of just randomly get away. So I'm going to go ahead and smite this. Shove it as fast as we can. And he's going to miss that whole wave there. Really nice. Kale doesn't have blue. Hello, let's go straight to blue buff. Anivia doesn't have blue either. That's a free blue buff for me. I got both the Kale's buffs. What the heck? And that's huge because we deny it off of Anivia. We're probably going to lose Dragon, but I wouldn't be able to stop that regardless. I'm going to come top again. I kind of want to just put this Hecarim in a bad spot here and kind of give him a little mini camp here. I don't have my ult just yet, so I might clear out some of these side camps real quick. And then hopefully we can just go and camp top lane a little bit. Yeah, there's nothing we could have done with that dragon, unfortunately. I wanted to, but nope. Right, this will be very, very well-timed uh, gank again in the top lane here. My ult's just going to be off cooldown. Hecarim just warded. I might even run... If 
through the tower. It kind of is risky, but I actually think I'm going to do it because I think he just warded river here. Yep, I'm going to do it. Alright, so I'm running through the tower here. Kind of crazy, but this is going to be a good gank. Gonna go ahead and just immediately alt the Hecarim here. Slow him down. There's the exhaust coming out of him. I didn't get the fallout that I wanted, but I got exhaust out of him for my alt, so that's pretty worth. I don't even think Rengar knew I was coming either. Sorry about that. Yeah. All good. All good. Got his exhaust out. That should help you in the lane. And I get to just keep farming, baby. We're full health, pretty much. Those double buffs that we stole from Kale coming up huge, just allowing us to farm forever. And we're going to go back with a ton of gold here. So that's really, really good. And we are just farming up. Farming like a varmin, baby. All right. I don't know if I want to go back just yet. <laughs> I have full mana, full health. So I might just try and utilize that and keep clearing this, these camps here. We'll use the blue buff to the full duration. And then we'll go ahead and go back. So I'll go ahead and smite to you once that comes off cooldown. Very nice. Anivia is roaming, and I think she did just... Yeah, she got the jump on them in the bot lane. I'm going to come straight bottom. Hopefully we can help them out here, but I think Thresh is going to go down. Nice calling. Yeah, we can we can make some plays happen here, baby. I'm going to turn off Blood Scent for now. And now we'll kick it back on. Oh, Kale, my dear. My dear. Oh, that was a really good ult. Nice, it just clipped her, put her in egg form here. This should be good for us. If she does just about break it, I'm gonna go ahead and alter so she can't do anything when she returns. There's the kill, I'll give that to Lux with Ignite. Very nice, I might flash in for this uh, Lulu. Nope, I'm gonna go ahead and try and help out the team here. Nice, we picked up the vein. This should be a kill on the Kale. Thresh, oh, Thresh barely died, damn. I feel bad, oh well. That was still good for us, still very, very good for us. We came out ahead there, and it was a one for three, and we're gonna take bot tower. So very, very nice trade for the team there. And I moved to 004 right now, and we have damn near 2,700 gold on that back. 2.7k to spend. What the hell? All right, time to get huge. We're gonna go ahead and buy that Spectre's cowl, and then we'll actually buy. Warden's mail as well for a random zone here. So we are just freaking out of nowhere tanky. I love it. Blue buff is going to be up soon, so I'll go ahead and run over to that. Lux can snag that if she so chooses. No, dragon. Uh, it's blue. Blue, not dragon. 24 stacks. Oh, nice. We almost have enough to uh, pick up Feral Flare. We'll grab that on the next back here because we do want to get the stacks. Cause that'd be good. No, they got dragon a long time ago, buddy. All right, Lux, here you go, my dear. Have a free Baluba. Oh god, I almost took it with an auto. That would have been bad. Nice, we got top tower as well. So things are looking really good for us right now. And we didn't go for a damage Warwick build. You could certainly go full damage if you wanted to, but the team really needed a tank, and this is Silky, so. It's the most optimal build for me to have to purchase here. Ooh, I think you're dead. You could have... Oh, he went with the Q instead of the W to heal himself. Probably not the right choice in my opinion, but maybe he knew he was just dead and was going for that kill anyways. I could scurry on up there to top lane to try and get a revenge kill. And we'll do that if he stays super long, but red buff's up. I want to grab that. Let's smite, smite. I'm not going to smite this early because kill was in the area, so I want to just secure this. Nice, red buff. Wow, Hecarim stayed. Okay, we should be able to actually pick up a kill on Hecarim here. Oh, what the? Piss off, Kale. I think she has her ult, but whatever. I'll be able to chase her for a mile and a half because I'm um, Weedwick. Get over. Oh my, it canceled. What is this game? Alright, we got flashes. Lux! Sniper! Oh, there's no tower. I can chase her for a day and a half. Like I said, I'm a genius. Alright, all we need is one auto attack, baby. Oh, she's fast. Okay, we got the slow. Ah, I'm chasing you for a mile. I don't care. I'll chase you. Get over here. There's one. And a two. And a three. Alright, we got her. <laughs> I wanted my first kill so bad. I was chasing the whole map for that thing. 
Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead. Oh, there are blue buffs up. Look at that. A blue buff for me. Thank you. Don't mind if I do. I just smited, but whatever. I'll be able to just auto attack this to death. Some time digression out of me here. Picking up a free blue buff because of it. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. Very nice. Very, very nice. And we'll go ahead and get the white camp of theirs, and then we will actually have enough for Feral Flare to be completed. So super far ahead, and that's just really scary for the enemy team. If a warrior gets ahead really early, it's like GG, no re, baby. I don't have my ult up. I think we can fight, but oh, 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 that wall is so good. I don't know what to do. That wall was so OP, dude. <laughs> like I wanted to go in, but damn. She has egg. Okay. Let's just kill Hecarim again. Oh. 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 Rip. The push ganks. Oh god. Nice snare as well. So there's another free kill. I'm gonna do the wolves right while I'm here. I have smite up. Might as well. What? It says my W's off cooldown, but I can't use it. I guess it's not really off cooldown. The game lies to me. Riot, please. Wolf, please. Oh, dragon's up. Damn it. Okay, I guess I'll run all the way over there. That was kind of a miss time by me. I don't even have smite, so I can't do much. I'm just gonna try and keep the Anivia in the mid lane, I guess. What? Oh, god. Please, no. I'm good. I'm tanky as hell. <laughs> this is like a tickle to me. Don't condemn me! Okay, we're good. I was actually pretty afraid for my life there. Just for a mere second, though. So I'm going to go back, pick up that Feral Flare. We'll go ahead and click you. Very nice. Lovely, lovely. And then we'll actually just get a Giant's Belt, the other component of Randy's. Very, very nice. I think you, my dear, you should be good. What? Did it not give me the extra stack for doing the wolves? Okay. Well, I should be able to chase down this Anivia here. If we can get that blood scent taken on us. We'll go ahead and drop the ward in here just to see. Okay, there she is. So. Does she have egg? Yeah, she does have egg. Oh, vein, my dear, though. My dear. Oh, you just used your escape, too. Damn. Good slow. Good slow. I still can chase, though. And we have Thresh kind of cutting them off here as well. Oh, I see you. I see you. I still got the ult off. La 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 la. And now I should be able to chase down this Anivia. Thresh, get in there. My boy. Oh, nice. He's got Talisman of Ascension already. Flay. Nice. Freaking genius. Can I smite? Oh, if you could smite her egg, that'd be hilarious. Help me, auto. I don't do any damage. Okay, you can have the kill. I don't want the kill. You take it. <laughs> We're just baiting out the Lulu ult. We're amazing. And Thresh ends up getting the kill anyways. GG. Alright, I'm 305. I'm gonna go ahead and just clear out this ward real quick. I, didn't, I don't want shit, man. I want to get you guys fed. That's what I want. Alright, blue buffs up. Lux, I mean, I wanted to give it to you, but you're all the way across the map, you know? Oh god, she's paying it, she wants it. Okay, I'll give it to you. I'll do the white camp here, why not? Alright. Gonna have enough for Reno and Summon after some clears of the jungle here, and then once we pick that up, I'm actually... I think I'm gonna just go damaged, because we're so far ahead, and honestly, just getting, like, Bork and stuff like that is fun to see on Warwick, so... I'm gonna go ahead and go with it. There's your blue, you damn bitch. Just kidding. You're doing pretty good. So, clearing out the wolves and then wraiths, and we should have enough for that Randy's. That's pretty huge for us in team fights. We can just alt someone, and if they're in the middle of the team fight, we can pop randoms while we're alting and slow down the whole team. And just get a lot of good soft CC on the enemy team. They have a bunch of CC actually, so I'm gonna pick up Merc Treads too once. We have enough gold for that. Uh, red buffs up. I guess I'll snag that before we go back here. Because I do have smite up as well. Man, this is what an easy game. I just got to farm all game and do whatever I want pretty much. So I cannot complain. Where did they die at? And is my whole team dead? Uh-oh. That exhaust. That'll... That'll kill a Rengar. Oh god, my team's kind of throwing. I don't like this. Knock it off, team. Oh god. We're actually, like, not in a good spot at all. Okay, nice flash, nice flash. 
I'm coming to save the day. Let's get the cleanup kills going. Gonna sneak off my blood scent here just so we can try and get behind them. And if they do push, I'm pretty damn confident I can go in here and live. Which is crazy sounding, but I think I can do it. I'm just gonna show up and we'll we'll attack some stuff a little bit. We'll absorb some damage. We'll pop the random wins. We're in there. Gonna go ahead and actually alt this Anivia because she's pissing me off just a little bit. There she goes. There's one. And we'll pop a war down for good measure. There's two. Can we get the third? There's the third. Damn, dude. I am tanky. Yeah, let's just let's just do the Baron. Who cares, man? Let's do it all. Alright, I got a pink ward for this. Beautiful. We can just nuke this. Got 760 on the smite here. And I'm super tanky, so I'm not even worried about this Baron hitting me. And this will be free. Should be free if Lucian doesn't kill himself here. What did I say? 760. Alright, gotta keep that in mind. Yep, this will be free. Kale's in the mid lane there. They have not a chance at stealing this. And we'll get a decent smite off. Smite it at like 560, I think it was, so not too bad. And we have enough for Merc Treads now. We can go back and get that. And that'll be good for us in upcoming team fights here. Nice, juicy wave for Rengar in the top lane there. And once we get this golem, we will head on out of here. Very nice. 407 is my score. 16 to 9 is the overall score. We do need to start working on knocking down some of these turrets here. So once we get that, that should be good for us. I'm actually going to buy a longsword now. Get that component of the Blade of the Rune King going for us. So yeah, we're freaking huge at this point. How, many, how much bonus damage do we have? Nice. That's a lot of damage, actually. So, we'll knock out these wraiths real quick while we... Eh, no, we won't. We'll go ahead. Nice double bind by that Lux there. We'll try and sneak up on the up-and-coming team fight here. Dragon up soon. We can definitely contest for that, having the Baron on us now. Here's a ward I'm just going to knock out real quick. Are they really going to shove into a team with Baron? Yeah, that's suicidal. We don't have Rengar just yet. He is working on coming over. Look at this, I'm like acting kind of crazy, but I can bait the crap out of this baby. I'm huge, do you know who I am? I'll fight you. See if I give a crap. Oh God, I'm not that big. Oh God, we're not that big. <laughs> all right, we'll just do dragon while my team fights. Next level plays. Okay, this is a bad idea. Don't do dragon anymore. <laughs> Definitely can confirm not as tanky as I thought I was, but we're still pretty tanky. Oh God. Nice, we got Hecarim. Yo, kill it. Oh, we got him cornered. We got him cornered, baby. No, we don't. Oh, okay, we got one. Lucian, attack stuff. I command you, attack. Okay, we'll just do dragon. All right, all right. 800 on the smite here. Do the dragon. Oh, God. Oh, God, don't leave me in here. Oh, it was all an elaborate plan. I'm a genius. All right. Team got the cleanup there, and there's the dragon for us as well. Ooh! Put her in an egg and scramble her up. Gonna go ahead and uh, nuke a you. Thank you. So 4010 now. Very, very nice. And I think I am gonna actually pick up that Banshee's Veil before we go Blade of the Rune King, just because I still need some immunity to me in team fights there. Our blue buff is up. We can get that for you after the back here. So. Oh, we Okay, we'll pick up Vamp Scepter, and then we'll finish that Banshee's just because we don't have enough for it just yet. Looks like she'll solo out on the blue. I'm lazy and don't want to help you. So I will just continue to farm my jungle here. Don't have Flash up just yet. I'm actually going to run straight to their blue, see if we can contest someone there. Rengar, go to their blue as well. Nice, 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 nice. Still have a little bit of Baron ticking on us, so that'll be good in any up-and-coming skirmishes that might appear. No, Kill got like her second blue of the game. I don't think Anivia has had a blue buff this whole game. Ooh, the spooky ward. Where did that come from? Super far away, because Feral Flare ward's OP. Oh. 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 Uh, 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 oh. Rengar cut her off. Oh. I just baited her. We sh we herded her like a sheep, boys. You're done for. I'm not even gonna ult you. 
I'm gonna ult the Hecker. Alright, we can fight. Oh god, no we can't. That's a vein. Bad idea is bad. Oh shh. Bad idea is bad idea. We're dead. But we're getting bought. Worth. Stall them. Stop the ports. Ult. Ult here. Ult it. No. Oh god, is she dead? Oh, can I miss? That'll... She'll live. You can walk it off. Walk it off. Alright, not bad, not bad. Kinda troll and baited my Rengar. Did not... Oh, alt that. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! Nice. So we end up getting one back, but... <laughs> definitely did not expect to see five of them there, honestly. I thought someone would go and stop that bot push a little quicker than they did. And we paid the price with it. I think, did they get two shutdowns or one? Okay, they just got one on me. So overall, it's not too bad. Who got the kill? Hecarim, whatever. Top Hecarim, pretty useless in my opinion. Not too worried about him getting that shutdown gold. But we definitely should group up as a team and just uh, force objectives here. That's free. I don't think she has all. Ah, no man, it's Kale. Her ult's always up. Gonna go ahead and just smite you. Get it on cooldown. Get you ticking. Gonna have our alt up real soon as well. That'll be good. So I do kind of want to go back and pick up Banshee's Veil because we have enough money for it, but I'm full health, almost full mana. I feel like it'd kind of be a waste at this point. So I'm just gonna do some camps here and then we'll see if any fights are up. Baron's up in a minute. Maybe I should go back now and get... I'm gonna go back and get that and then we'll get a pink ward as well. I don't even have enough money for that, never mind. We'll just get the Banshees. I want that for the up and coming Baron fights though. Definitely a good item to have. Alright. I should not die in any team fights anymore if I play it right. So let's group and we can kill them all. Slay them all. Alright, what do you do you have no you went tell us never mind. I want the siege minion. Thank you very much. Baron up real soon. Don't have that. Oh, never mind. <laughs> My pink ward still stands. OP. Gonna go ahead and just clear out this ward that was just freshly put here. Thank you. I think someone got their blue. I know it just came up. Ooh, is that Kale actually big? She's decently big. I think Anivia got it. Hello, Kale. How are you doing? Are we fighting? We can actually fight. I'm here. I'm gonna go ahead and alt the Anivia right away. She's kind of misplaced here. And Rengar should hop in. There's the Lux laser. Nice Zonius. Really nice Zonius. Like, legit. And kill ults her, actually. So, Vayne is in the fray kind of alone. I'm tower diving, yo. I'm going deep. I don't care, because I'm a Warwick. I'm still thinking. Ah! I'm not going to risk it. I'm flashing that wall. I don't give a crap, dude. All right, we got the kill. That should be an inhib for us. Lots of map pressure going down. Baron's gonna be respawning soon as well. Can definitely take that off the inhib if we so choose. I'll just do white while we wait and let them uh, come over to Baron here. So I'll just life steal up a little bit. Boom, 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 boom. Not even gonna finish it. I just want just a little bit of health while we go here. Yeah, we can do it quick. 850 on my smite. Not a big deal, we'll destroy this thing with Rengar as well as my Feral Flare here. Yep, goodbye Baron. Oh, getting melted. Ah, that was not a good smite, but whatever, we got it. So, going back, I should have enough for Bilge and then a dagger here. Not enough for Bork though. Alright, 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 very nice. Very, very nice. Have so many usable items. I'm not used to this on the jungler. I'm used to seeing this on the support here. But 5-1-12 is our score here. And compared to the Kale, who's 3-4-6, I'd say we definitely did work as far as out jungling our opponent here. Dragon is up. I definitely want to get this. Uh, blue. We'll do a pit stop for blue buff here for the Lux. Hopefully you can uh, snag this here. Stop doing my wolves and get your damn blue. I'm giving it to you. What? <laughs> Whatever. You ain't paying attention. I'm taking it. We got dragons to slay. And this is incredibly risky because I don't know where anyone is. But YOLO. You can have that turret. Oh, God. Bad idea is bad. I'm caught. I'm dead. <laughs> or am I? Yeah, I'm dead. 
so worth though, am I right? We gave them dragon and a kill. It's all part of the plan. And a turret. Alright. Yo. Oh! Nice. Can maybe pop Lulu? Don't die, though! Oh, she's... Never mind. She's actually tanky. You guys should run away. Oh, but we have mid so That's really good. That's huge that they just got that tech. No way he engages on that. What a psycho. You don't do any damage. And she's just gonna... Yep. Okay, suicide, and then our minions are just gonna do work in the mid lane here, so... Kinda suicide, and Rengar... Ooh, Rengar! Nice, put her in the egg, that'll be a kill there, he should be able to pop her. With another Q... There it is, the double Q, very nice. You're done for, there's gonna be the ace, he's gonna hop to the bush, there it is. Very nice, I think Dragon's gone. But I thought more than likely it will be the game. So, really good stuff out of the team there. It was all me, dude. I made them use all of their small cooldowns that came back up in that next team fight. <laughs> Alright, we'll just farm all my team ends. There's no reason for me to go there. They're just gonna end the game. Or they should end the game. Ooh, you're dead. You're not dead. There goes one tower, there goes two towers. And that's gonna do it for me 5 2 and 12 another w coming out of me as always guys if you like the video i'll have all my other social media such as twitch twitter and facebook as well as in some messages in the info box below and we will go ahead and click out of here to see how much lp we get the double explosion bad game coming out of the hecarim top questionable but okay give me the continue there it is how much lp do we get i want to say 25 We'll see. Stats, please. Sometime today, Junior. Oh, that 28. Ooh, we're at 94 LP. All right, so next win will put us into our series for Gold 3. Probably we'll skip that and go to Gold 2. So we shall see in the next episode, guys. I will see you all later.